Hello and welcome to our next video after a very long break. This is already our 10th video from the construction of Carbon B. Time flies quickly and we actually wanted to put this video together earlier, but as usual, either there wasn't enough footage or we were too busy with building, designing the next steps, technical solutions, or searching for the right materials and parts. We started in late spring with the interior construction and some unfinished structural reinforcements. The interior construction is made from very light sandwich panels that require edge reinforcement. This process involves removing the foam from the edge and replacing it with a structural resin-based compound. We tried different methods to remove the foam without damaging the outer layers. First, we used a drill with a milling cutter. Later, we tried a router with an improvised table. Unfortunately, none of these solutions met our expectations and were stressful. Finally, we managed to buy a small router with a special attachment and removing the foam became a pleasure. Our sofa in the living room is taking shape. Here, I am laminating the seat in the rear cabin.
Kevin is laminating the structural reinforcements around the centerboard case, while I am laminating the floor panels for the hull. These panels close the buoyancy compartments and simultaneously strengthen the hull at the waterline. Our friends came to help us paint the interior of the hulls and the cabin roof. We are painting with transparent epoxy resin through which you can see the carbon fibers. Peter? Bogdan? And Helmut? Yes. And Zeret Raja? Yes, of course. In the hulls, we leave this visible, shiny, and shimmering carbon fiber structure, but we decided to finish the roof in the salon differently. The weather warmed up, and since Carbon B is still in the water, we decided to install a ladder so we could enjoy a swim after work. You can still see Kevin and the little bee working on structural reinforcements in the centerboard case area and the main beam.
Meanwhile, Anna had her birthday. We are often visited by our friends, and the children have lots of fun on the trampoline and in various storage compartments in the hulls. Not just work on the construction, but also time to relax on the trampoline. And with this positive note, we end this video. Thank you for watching and for your motivating comments. See you in the next video.